Well, now to a Fox Extreme weather alert. Today marks the official start of the Atlantic hurricane season as Secretary of Homeland Security John Kelly visits with government forecasters for his briefing on what might be in store for the nation this year. So what should we expect? Chief Meteorologist Rick Breitmuth is live in the Fox Weather Center, and that's who we ask. So what can we expect? I tell you what, it's hard to believe we're here again. Uh, six months long is the season, so I guess that's why it comes around so fast. But it goes all the way through the end of November. Uh, and there are above average, the SST, sea surface temperatures, so warmer than average temperatures across the ocean that gives more fuel. And because of that, we think that it will probably be uh, a more active season than usual. Anywhere you see this yellow, that's above average. The blues are below average. There is here in the Gulf a little patch of blue, so some temperatures there are a little bit below average. That probably won't last long. And overall, you see these warmer temperatures here across the Atlantic. There is also neither an El Nino nor a La Nina going on that is any significant signal there. That's the water temperature down off the coast there of South, uh, South America. Because of that, we think there will probably be an above average season. This is what NOAA's prediction is these are our averages and you get the idea in the named storms the hurricanes and the major hurricanes all better than average chance to have a little bit above average season these are your names we've already had one storm that was our lean and it was in the month of November so that's gone the big thing to note is here we are at the beginning of June things don't really get ramped up until you get in towards July uh, into August actually and then we peak kind of in September so that's what we're looking at here if we do see something earlier on in the season forms here across the Western Caribbean and gets generally here into the Gulf. And a lot of times we see some sort of a landfalling storm here in the Gulf, so we'll certainly watch that closely. Right now, we do have one storm we're watching down on the southern, southern shore of Mexico, bringing a lot of rain in towards the Oaxaca area. But overall, Heather, we are expecting to see above average season. Of course, if a tree falls in the forest, doesn't matter. If a tree falls right on the U.S. coastline, if a hurricane happens here, then it causes big impacts. That's what we're going to watch. Yeah, it sure does. And I saw the name Brett on that list, so we'll have to let Brett. Bear know about yeah, that. Right. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Thank you, Rick.